Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today is International Sandwich Sunday, and we are headed to Brazil for the Xixtudo. Now, let's just get one thing out of the way. This is a hamburger, but it's a pretty over-the-top hamburger. And yes, a hamburger is a sandwich, in my estimation. First thing we're going to do is season our ground beef with a little salt and pepper, garlic powder, and a pinch of cumin. Now we cook our burger for three minutes on one side. Now we cook it on the other side for three minutes. Now we top it with a slice of mozzarella cheese and cover it to melt it. Now let's toast our bun. Okay, to kick things off, we mayonnaise each side of our bun. That's right, mayonnaise is a verb. Butter can be a verb, mayonnaise is a verb. We put on a leaf of lettuce, cooked corn kernels, thick slice of tomato, our hamburger with melted cheese, fried egg, ham, black pepper, bacon, and of course, shoestring potatoes. And ketchup. This is insane, Brazil. This is insane. Okay, let's give this chistudo a go. I'm so glad I put down a tarp. <laughs> this is uh, ridiculous, uh, impossible to eat, but ultimately tasty. I mean, hamburger is good. The seasoning on that is nice with the cumin and the garlic powder and the fresh tomato, the smoky bacon. The ham's getting a little lost. The corn's getting a little lost. Um, yeah, this is good. I can't believe we're going to say this. I kind of want to plus it up a little. Now, normally I would add some sort of Brazilian ingredient, but this is such a mashup already that I'm just going to go ahead and haul off with the Nukes Grillo's Pickles Hot Sauce. It's going to be pickly and it's going to bring a little heat. And yeah, I put it on that side because it's easier. Okay, let's give this Chistudo a plus up with the Nukes Grillo's Pickles Hot Sauce. Go. It is nice because it is bringing a little bit of heat and a little bit of a pickly brine flavor to kind of perk things up. First of all, if you want to make the shistudo, I followed a recipe from easyanddelish.com. It was posted by Denise Browning, uh, who is from Brazil. So thank you, Denise. Appreciate it. But I got to say, this is a crazy, over-the-top, everything hamburger. Um, if I didn't know that ham was in there, just going off taste long, I don't know that I would have been able to tell that it was in there. But it was a tasty burger, but it was really hard to eat. So I'm going to give it about, I'm going to give it an eight and a half because of the difficulty of eating it. Flavor-wise, fantastic. Uh, plussed up with the Nukes Grillo's Pickles Hot Sauce. I'm going to say that's like a nine, nine and a half. It is just a little bit of a, a little bit of brightness, a little bit of heat. Goes great with everything in there. The smoky bacon, the melty cheese, the hamburger, the crispy, salty potato sticks. Um, it is tasty. I'm definitely going to finish that. It might take me a couple days because it's huge. Uh, but yeah, I don't know that I would make this again because it's so hard to eat. But uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to finish it. <laughs> All right. See you tomorrow.